Episode 1 on time series that influence our lives was about ocean waves. How high they can get is determined not only by the wind that builds them up, but also by special celestial constellations. If, for example, the centers of gravity of the Sun and the Moon lie on the same axis to Mother Earth, this results in exceptional tides and can lead to exceptional waves. In order to be able to predict such celestial events, the 17th century astronomer Tycho Brahe created star tables in which he noted which celestial body could be seen where and when, the geographical position of the observer, the date, the time and the azimuth. This was actually a collection of time series. However, they did not fit in at all with the assumption of that time that celestial bodies moved in circular orbits. Time series and model did not fit together. Celestial bodies couldn't be seen at the predicted times. The solution to the phenomenon was provided by the ingenious German mathematician Johannes Kepler on the basis of Brahe's star tables. He brought the time series together with a suitable model. The discovery of elliptical orbits was groundbreaking. Kepler's laws still are the foundation of astronomy today. Astronomers know that time series are the basis of progress because life is a time series.